So today I have some really exciting news to share. I'm going to be taking y'all on a tour of Luca's Nursery. Yes, it is finally done. It is finally here. Um, I have been wanting to show y'all the final look for quite some time, but I have just been holding out on y'all because I wanted to have everything come in. I wanted everything hung. I wanted everything to look good. And so everything is finally done. So I'm going to show y'all his nursery. I'm so excited. Um, this process was actually really fun for me. I've never decorated a room before. And, uh, you know, so because I, I couldn't do my pole fitness for months and months and months. And so I needed some kind of project. I needed something to keep me preoccupied. I needed something to keep me busy. And so it took about three months and I just kind of started with Pinterest and I YouTubed a few things, but I wanted some kind of like bohemian jungle, kind of modern theme for a baby boy. And so I came across a few things that I liked and then I kind of just branched off and just kind of explored. I did a lot of research, I did a lot of shopping. <laughs> um, and so, yeah, so I hope you like it. You'll have to drop a comment below and let me know what you think, um, especially if you're having a, a baby yourself and you need some inspiration. Um, I will have links to all of the products and all of the items in his nursery. So you can just click right on the link and it'll take you there um, and you can get some inspiration. <laughs> um, but yeah, so let's get started. I'm going to take you all with me and I'll show you everything. And like I said, just drop a comment below. Let me know what you think and let's get started. All right. So this is Luca's nursery. Ta-da! So this is what you see when you first walk in. I'm just going to turn the light on so y'all can see better. All right. So I think I'm going to start in this corner over here. So this first item here, this is a bare laundry hamper. And this is quite possibly one of my favorite items in his whole nursery. Um, it's just, I'm obsessed with it. I just love that it has a top that you can take on and off. And so it can keep all of his dirty clothes hidden. And it's nice and big. It's sturdy. It has a little bear on it, which goes with the jungle theme. Um, this was actually a gift from my husband's work friends, and it is from Bye Bye Baby. So, I love it. Um, this back here is um, a plant from Home Goods. I love the basket. I love how it ties in with the bear. Um, and then I just love that that green color just gives the room a, a little bit of a pop. And it just goes with that jungle theme so well. Up here, we have his baby monitor. You can see that we tried to hide it um, with the plant. So that is one. We have his second monitor up here on that shelf. And so we can get all the angles. Um, we have a little panda wall decal from Bye Bye Baby. Um, and then up here, let me show y'all this wall. So we have love them, but let them be wild. Such a boy thing. Love it. Um, this again is a part of a set of all these wall decals from Bye Bye Baby. Um, we have his dresser. This is from Wayfair. I just love this like white, clean, solid look. The depth of the drawers is nice. Um, I just wanted to keep it nice and simple. Um, so again, super affordable from Wayfair. And then we have all of his safari animals here. This was actually the first purchase I made in his room and I just kind of branched off from that. And so this is kind of where the inspiration started. But um, the prints are really, really great quality from Etsy, um, a, a painter. And so I don't know if y'all can see that with the glare. 
but really, really good quality. Um, I bought the frames from Amazon, and I just love that natural wood color. And so moving down here, we just have a little basket. And this basket is from Bye Bye Baby. And you can see I've already got some diapers and wipes set up, ready to go. This is his changing basket. This is from a company called Design Dua. And I just love, love, love the colors. I love the basket. I love the leather handles. Um, I don't know how functional it will be. Um, I will have to let you know about that one. Um, I'm going to be laying down some changing pads and blankets because I just don't want to get poop on this. So I'll have to check back in with y'all about that one. But yes, um, so the next thing, his little diaper genie, white. Um, it's from Bye Bye Baby. This was actually from my best friend. I'm super thankful because you can just step on this and it's got the trash bags already in it ready to go so that will make diaper changing nice and easy. Um, on this side we've got his accordion rack. Um, this is from Amazon so you can just kind of hang like his hats or just you know whatever we want um, really on that. So. I thought that was nice and functional and it also goes really well with the wood frames. You can see that we already have something hung. This is from a close family friend. She actually monogrammed the backpack herself. So love the jungle theme. Super cute. All right, so next we'll look at this wall. All right, I don't know if y'all can see that. So we have his cloud um, shelf here. This is from Amazon and um, his blocks that spell out his name. I believe that's from Etsy. That was from our lovely neighbor um, just down the street. She is amazing. And so yeah, so we love those blocks. And then we've got his eight cube storage organizer. Um, nice and big, lots of depth. Um, this is from Walmart. I believe the company is uh, Home Gardens or something like that. Um, but yeah, super affordable, really nice white clean look. We've got the four baskets on the bottom are from Amazon. And right now we just have things like diapers, linens, um, muslin blankets, and burpee cloths, bibs swaddles, things like that. I'm sure we'll have to do some reorganizing once he comes um, to know like what we need. Um, but yeah, and then the top two baskets, those are from Amazon as well. I love the white and the leather contrast handles. Um, so I thought that went really well with the leather handles there. Um, so yeah, we have his some toys there and then his little baby shoes when he starts walking, his little moccasins. And then this sign actually we used um, for our announcement and we just thought it went really well in his room. Um, a close friend of ours actually made that for us and she is just super talented. Um, and then we have um, that little Decor there is from Hobby Lobby. Um, and then that mirror is actually from Target. Um, I had a hard time finding mirrors because they can get pretty pricey, but I felt that Target was the most affordable. Um, so we ended up going with Target. And um, I actually love the colors because it's kind of like a a darker brown. Um, it actually goes pretty well with his nightstand cable. Um, I think they complement each other pretty well. Um, and then just with like the lighter browns, the natural wood, I think it, it does complement it. But just let me know what y'all think in the comments. 
And then we have his two little shelves here. These are from Amazon. Great buy. Um, I love the leather straps again. Natural wood. Um, and then below we have another wall decal. And that's just a little baby lion. Um, and again, that's from Bye Bye Baby. And so this picture here was actually like his first ultrasound pic where we could see his full face. And it was just so cute, just being able to see his face for the first time. And so we had that framed. And then we have his little name plaque here, which we'll be taking to the hospital with us to fill out. Um, we're actually doing a game right now for the people who um, were in our baby shower. So whoever predicts the closest will get a prize. So we're excited about that. Um, and yeah, so we've got his little chew toy bracelet. So when he starts teething, I just like the colors. And then we've got his little baby shoes, which we'll also take to the hospital with us. Um, and then this picture up top, this is the latest ultrasound pic. You can really see the difference that his face is just really fattened up and he just looks so cute. Um, but he's definitely camera shy, so. Um, but yeah, so though that is this wall. And next we have his swing. This is um, another favorite of mine in his nursery. I just love this swing. It's super cute. Um, it's not going to be quite so functional. It's more for you know, looks and decoration, but it is from a company called Et, uh, Sweet Swinging. I don't know if y'all can see that. Yeah. And so this was from Etsy and they have different colors and they have different kinds of pillows that you can put in there. Um, but yeah, so it's actually hooked to the ceiling. It is in a stud, so it is not going anywhere. It's very sturdy. Um, but because there's just not much room, uh, we probably won't be doing a lot of swinging, maybe just sitting. <laughs> um, but it is nice that you can just take it right off the hook and you can hang it somewhere else. You can hang it on a tree outside if you want. So that'll be fun. We also decided to put a hook up here and so when we're not using the swing we can just hook it to the wall which will be nice um, and then we have this little moon sign this is from Hobby Lobby as well um, I was actually really surprised when I went um, I didn't know that Hobby Lobby had um, nursery decor but yeah, they actually have a lot of really cute stuff. And this sign actually is from Hobby Lobby as well. It says, For this child I have prayed. It's 1 Samuel 127, which I love that scripture. Um, so yeah, so definitely check out Hobby Lobby because they have really great prices and lots of cute nursery things. Okay, so now we have his curtains. And I'm sorry, I know the light is kind of really shining through. Um, but yeah, these are from Ikea. Um, really good price. And they're just white. They are blackout, which will be nice when he's trying to nap during the day. And then we just have some plain shears behind it. Um, Y'all are going to think I'm crazy, but I have literally steamed those curtains like five times already. Um, because, you know, they say when you're this close, you start to nest and basically you just go crazy. And so I have steamed those things so many times and I'm probably going to steam them again before he comes. So just a side note. <laughs> um, but yeah, so those are the curtains. We also have blinds that we'll pull down, which will also help keep some of that sun out. And then... Down below, this is, see if y'all can see that, there we go. Um, this little elephant rocker, so adorable, it's from Pottery Barn Kids. Um, this is from our lovely aunt in Brazil. 
and it will just be so cute when he's old enough to sit on it and rock and play with it. And I just love the gray color with the natural wood. Um, so it just kind of introduces another color to the room. And um, yeah, so it's just one of my favorite things. This is another wall decal. We just have some plants here um, down below, which I thought was just cute. And so next up we have his little chair. Um, this is from Wayfair. Um, I just love the color. It's kind of like a creamy white kind of ivory. It's just very clean, very pretty, soft. Um, and it's actually really comfortable. Um, and then we have this poof ottoman to go with it and that is from Target. Um, so you can just kind of prop your feet up, um, and so that'll be nice. And then we have his blanket here. This is from my husband's mom. Um, this is from Potter Pottery Barn Kids, and she actually had his named monogrammed on it. So it's a really pretty blanket, and it introduces another color, blue, which I really wanted. Um, so it's got the baby blue, it's got the browns. So again, it just really complements all the other colors. And then we have this little baby elephant, which I thought was so cute. Um, this is again, a part of the wall decal set from Bye Bye Baby. And um, uh, I already told you about that sign. That's from Hobby Lobby. And then we have his shelves. So this is kind of like the reading room. Um, so the shelves are from Amazon and all the books are from our baby shower. Um, so lots of cute little books. I really like this good night little Luca. It is a personalized book and it has um, his name on every single page. Really good quality pictures, beautiful colors. It's just a gorgeous book. And so then we have his little nightstand table. Um, so y'all are gonna think I'm crazy, but the height um, was really bothering me. And so I've been kind of contemplating back and forth. Should I cut the legs of the table off just a little bit to bring it down? Because when you're sitting in this chair, you have to kind of reach over to put things on the table. And so I didn't like that. Um, but my husband just thinks I'm crazy and, you know, doesn't think it's a big deal. So drop a comment below. Let me know what you think if we should trim those legs off or just keep it the way it is. Um, because I know that I'm just hormonal and going crazy and just super in my head. So just let me know what you think. But yes, I love the color. Um, the table is from Home Goods as well. Um, and then we have this cute little monogrammed pillow um, that is from the same family friend that made this little backpack for him. Um, so again, it ties in the, that jungle theme and just kind of gives the room some more pop of a color. Um, and so really good. So th this right here is the hatch. This will be his sound machine. It lights up, it's Bluetooth, so that'll be nice. And then that's the, the monitor there. All right, so moving on, we have the crib. So the crib is from Da Vinci Baby, and we actually bought it um, from Bye Bye Baby because we had a, a bigger discount there. And um, so yes, yeah, so Bye Bye Baby will sell Da Vinci Baby products. Um, and so we just love the crib. It's nice and white, it's clean, it's got the shiplap look, um, which is just really cute. And then we have the crib mobile, which has baby elephants and clouds and it plays music. And this is actually from our, um, my brother and sister-in-law all the way in Australia. So 
super thankful for that. I know he's going to love it. Um, and so we have this crib skirt and this quilt. This is from my mom and it's got, um, it brings in the grays, which I love. And it, um, we've got this little elephant here, which is just, you know, kind of fun for him to play with. And it's got, um, you know, he can take selfies with it and we can, you know, just snuggle with him. And so it'll be nice. Um, and then the bedding is actually from Pottery Barn Kids. And again, just bringing in those gray colors. Um, so yeah, and then this blanket here is actually from my aunt. Um, and it is crochet hand woven um, and it is just beautiful. I just love all those colors together. So that'll be nice. Um, and then, so, oh, and before I forget, so this quilt actually came as part of a set. And so it actually came with all of the wall decals that you see on the wall. Um, and so that was all from Bye Bye Baby. So I thought that was you know, kind of neat that they included wall decals um, as part of the bedding set. So definitely check Bye Bye Baby out. Um, and then what else? The, his sign. Okay, so his sign is from Etsy. Um, we actually designed this ourselves. You can actually pick from like preset designs that they ha already have um, or you can go on to like a software program and you can design it yourself. So we picked out the font and we picked out the colors and I wasn't sure how it would turn out but I am pleased to say that I think it turned out pretty good. Um, let me know what y'all think in the comments. But yeah, the colors I like the, that Barbieri is that brown. It's kind of like a cocoa, like a coffee color. And I just think it really, you know, pops against that black and natural wood. So yeah. And then I think the only thing left, um, I forgot to mention was the rug here. This rug is actually from Target. Um, good price. I love the grays. I think it goes really well with the gray elephant um, and the gray bedding. So it just kind of brings everything together. Um, it kind of has like a sort of a bohemian vibe to it, um, especially with the, the poof ottoman. And so, yeah, so that is his rug. Um, and then... I think that is it. I mean, we have his closet here. Um, it's not done yet, but we have, we do have his clothes kind of hung up and then we have his shoes, but we still need to organize it. We probably need to buy another piece of furniture to, you know, store all his clothes. Um, but yeah, everything is at least hung up and then we've got all of his diapers and all that fun stuff up top. But yes, definitely need some work. So that, that is that. I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing his nursery. I was so excited to share it with y'all today. And I just, you know, I had a lot of fun with this process and um, you know, I still have to decorate the rest of the rooms in the house, so we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, it was really fun and, you know, I hope you guys liked it. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think. Um, again, I'll have links to all of the products, um, in the nursery in the comment section. So if you really like something, just click on the link and it'll take you right there. Um, so I hope it gives you some sort of inspiration. Um, to kind of go off of and yeah so let me know what you think have a great day thank y'all love y'all bye bye